Hello one and all, and welcome to a new Let's Play with your host, Nantaos. The game is Nerd and Torchlight 2. With me, of course, is the same crew from Diablo, and they're going to do their little introductions, just like normal. Alright, first up is Riven. Hey guys, what's up? And then, we have Alpha Compton. Hey guys. And then, of course, is Avox. Hello. And we don't have a flag. <laughs> we don't we don't have flags. <laughs> yeah, we don't have flags in this game, so I, we have to figure out a way to actually do our in, our regular intro. But we'll worry about that in the next episode. But yeah, this is Torchlight Two. If you haven't already figured it out or seen the title, and I guess we're going to be talking to this guy right here, the, the Destroyer. Um, yeah. So yeah. I think we all got to talk to him. Oh really? Yeah. Oh, wow, that's interesting. Okay, well. Uh, what is he, like a mercenary? Or is that a mission? Um, <clears throat> he's actually one of the previous characters from the last game. He's one of the characters you play as. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, we got the quest. Uh, basically, like, the whole game, you're, you're chasing after one of the other classes from the last game, the alchemist. Yeah. Power corrupted him, unfortunately. Yeah. Yeah, I haven't really played extensively on Torchlight 1, uh, so I, I kind of know just the basic gist of the game, but I don't know. We'll go with it. We'll go with it. We still have animals, which is kind of cool. Um, I have to actually have a pet dog. Yeah. I named her Fifi. If you want to introduce your <laughs> animals. Yeah, yeah. My God. And we're play, playing in veteran mode, right? Yeah, this is currently veteran mode, which is like the third difficulty, which should be pretty good. And uh, I don't see any difficulty yet. I think it's only to start the game. <laughs> but yeah, like I mentioned, this is pretty much the uh, the same crew as Diablo 3. Um, if you haven't really seen that playthrough, I'll probably have it annotated somewhere uh, for you guys to check out. Uh, yeah. What's kind of hard about this game, though, is it's hard to tell which is enemy now because, like, I know. I agree. Have... Um, I, I just felt like a similar um, like difficulty. Uh, keep in mind that yeah, the, it's completely different from Diablo Three. So, like, there aren't any more health clubs. So watch your health there, and you can use potions. There's no health what? In Diablo 3, when we played, um, there were health globes that dropped to restore our health. Here, each person has to use potions to heal themselves. Oh, that's right. That's yeah. Right. And <clears throat> they're not on a long cooldown or anything, so you can... I think it's only 8 seconds. You can use it after 8 seconds, so you're good. Yeah, but it, it works for 8 seconds, so it, it, it's fine. Yeah, that's good. It's good to know. You got eight seconds of healing. Uh, and of course, his hotkeys they heal us. The one is hotkey for potions. Number two is for uh, I guess mana. Right. Yeah. Oh, I leveled up. Oh, me too. Um, I don't exactly know how the loot works in this game. I think. I don't think we have uh, our own separate loot. Oh, we don't? Yeah, I'm not really sure. You would know more than I me. I think it does. I read that it does. Oh, oh really? Okay. Oh. oh, no. Got giant behemoths here. Okay, that's good. That's good. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Assistance in the freaking front window. All right. 150 fame. Can I, someone explain to me this fame? I noticed it, I saw um, fame. Um, it, it, it's basically like how I, popular you are. And uh, once you get your fame high enough, you get a new, you get to learn a new skill every time you rank up your uh, fame. So it's another way of getting more power in Torchlight too. Nice. Hey, guys, come come up here for a minute. Up north. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, you'll you'll randomly run into these locked golden chests. Okay. But you can yeah you can open it with the key that you pick up from some enemies. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. 
Ooh, I got. I already have a suckable item. Yeah. I guess those are pretty common in in the beginning. Yeah, yeah. Um, what I like about this game more than Diablo 3 is that uh, cooler items drop more, more frequently. Is that by design or is it like... Yeah, yeah, it's intentional, yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. And leveling up is completely different as well. Um, if you look at your, the left side of your screen, you, you should see a character pan button. A char uh, character... Yeah, yeah, panel, yeah. Oh, actually... Yeah, uh, you basically get... Yeah, you get five points whenever time you level up, and you could distribute yeah. them however you want. I want more vitality. Give me... Yeah, and skills. on the right side, there's a button that, that says skills. On the whenever time you level up, you get a skill point, and you can put one point into any skill you want. That's pretty sexy. I like that. Yeah. Uh, each skill can hold 15 points, so... Uh, yeah. Cool beans. <clears throat> yeah, I haven't played the uh, Torchlight 1 that much, so I'm kind of trying to uh, familiarize myself with the shortcuts, the hotkeys. Alright, cool. Yeah. The game plays much more closer to uh, Diablo 2 than Diablo 3. Diablo yeah, that's cool. Oh my god. Come on, don't die. Use a potion. I only have, well, I actually have quite a bit of potions. Okay, never mind. I thought I only had like two left. Oh yeah. Like that across your face. Oh my god, I need help. There's a lot of <laughs> enemies over here. Yay, I leveled up. Yay, sorry about that. <clears throat> yeah, I leveled up too. So weak. Is anybody like a healer per se in this game? Nope. No? No. That kind of sucks. Yeah, you're kind of... You have to rely on your own potions and stuff. Each, each man is responsible. Yeah, yeah. No. Or woman. What about our animals? Do, do, do they like have health our, as well? Our, our animals can be given a potion, but their health does regenerate uh, fairly quickly. Okay, nice. Uh, health. Um, what is this? Okay, cool. I'm not in the game anymore, right? What's up? Oh yeah, you're not in the game. Or am I still there? Where'd you go? Yeah, I, I dropped. I'll be back in a minute. No, I'll be back in a minute. Yeah, it's my internet again. <laughs> Regarding the pets, the pets, they, they're kind of cool. They, you can send them back to town with items. Yeah. Oh, you mean they, they actually have like their own like equipment? You can actually give them equipment yeah they have their own inventory yeah yeah that's nice oh yeah the, the pet if you look at the top left yeah the pet panel uh look at fifi i wonder if they, they actually grow up or like evolve that'd be kind of cool uh i don't think so <laughs> yeah i don't think so let's go this way then all right right behind you but uh, um, I'm not exactly sure what, what's really going on because we just started the game. Uh, I believe our active quest right now is saying to warn the Australians. Is that how you pronounce it? Um, Asterians? Yeah, Asterians. Yeah. yeah, it sounds about right. And, uh, okay. Yeah, Riven is offline right now, but he'll, he'll come back. He's still on Skype, though, which is kind of strange, but he's just not on the game. How'd you actually... Did you like No, for some odd reason, it, the game isn't letting me log in again. Oh, really? It's kind of strange. Yeah. Stop doing that, um...
All right, cool. Heading into town. All right, we got the entrance. Yeah. I think we have to stop the um the grand region. Oh, this guy right here. Yep. The big question mark. That's him. That's kind of cool. We can choose our awards. Yeah. That's pretty cool. I do like that. Yeah. I want this giant hammer. Cool beans. Oh, Riven is back online. That's good. All right, cool. Now we have to protect the guardian. Actually, I want to check out the shop real quick, see if there's anything good. I might have to buy some more potions, actually. Just in case. Yeah, make sure you, you have a healthy supply of potions. Um, Alpha, do you want to explain the respec system here? Okay, uh, with the respec system, um, it's a little different than what we're used to in Diablo 3. In Diablo 3, we're able to change skills anytime we want, uh, with just a little cooldown. Um, with Torchlight 2, your skill choices are more permanent. However, yep. um, you do have the choice when you go back to town, the last three upgrades that you made to your skills, you're able to undo them for a fee and get the skill point back. Ah, oh, interesting. Yeah, so just the last three. So you do have the ability to play around with a few upgrades or try out a new skill. And you know, pay to change it if you don't like it. Cool. But you know, when you go down later in the line, you'll have to, you know, just make sure you choose skills that, you know, you want. Yeah. All right. Makes sense. Yeah. But um, I suggest you you try at each skill. Like you put a point, like one point in each skill. Yeah. You know. So. I agree. You can play around with it a little bit, but the ones you want, like focus on that and add as much points as you as you want. All right. Okay, I unlocked that one level seven. That one's fourteen. Um, Avox, you, uh, I don't know. I can't wear this, but I think you can. Can't what? It, it's a uh, armor. It might be an upgrade for you. I don't know. Riven, how did you... you just drop it on the ground? Yeah, yeah, I dropped it on the ground. Yeah, I, I accepted another quest. I'm not sure if you see it. Wait, uh, Avox, were you able to... Yeah, yeah, it's... I don't see it. Okay, do you see it now? I don't see it. No. Okay, uh, let me try trading with you. Yeah, just trade it. Is that... What's that shared stash? Oh, I see. That's for, for your other characters. Um, I just need you to accept the trade? Okay. Um, you guys ready to bounce? Yeah. All right, cool beans. I'd um, I guess. Well, I'm not sure if you see it, but I, I accepted another quest. It's called the War Beast Armory. Right here. Yeah. If I accept the quest, does does that automatically go to you guys, or do you need individually? No. I I had to individually uh, talk to the guy. I don't think it works like that in this game. Well, kind of. That's kind of weird though, because I thought this was this was, this was the co-op. I thought. I don't know. It is. It's kind of weird. It's like it's co-op is still individual. My my charge meter takes forever to go up. Uh um guys, uh I believe everyone has this. I'm not sure. Um a charge meter. A charge uh, basically meter. Basically, it's charging up um if you get it all the way, at least I know with the ember mage, if you get the meter all the way up, you um you get unlimited amount of uh mana. For a short time, so you can just cast and keep casting, and you do more damage. Yeah. Where do you skill. see that? It's it's right above your your hotkey your hotkey bars. Yeah. Oh, you're talking about the best health potion? No. No, above that. Be a bar, a little bar that fills up. Like if you attack this dummy, you'll see the bar fill up. Above my health? Um, no. Uh, it should be in the middle of the screen. Oh, the engin engineer charge bar. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, all right. Cool. What, what does that do? Um, I think the, the more you hit enemies, it fills up. Oh, okay. Yeah. Try hitting this target dummy. Okay. Should fill up. 
I don't cool. exactly know what the engineer does, but yeah. All right. You guys ready? Yep. Yeah, let's go. Let's go to um, the, the exit with the star. Oh, wait, let's talk to this guy. Well, yeah, I, I already talked to him, oh. but I guess you can talk to him too because we already we're pretty much doing that quest. If you if you see it. Did you already, did you already accept it? Yeah. Okay. Cool. Okay. All right. Let's go. Um. Okay. Okay. All right. Um. Where did we go? Um. You see on the mini map, you can find arrows. Uh. Yeah. 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 Yo! It wouldn't let me move. What the hell? Oh, it's lagging. It's lagging. No, I don't think it was lag. It, it was <laughs> just. Oh my god, I need to heal, 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 heal. Holy crap, guy. Oh, I can't believe I died just off the bat like that. Man, you suck. Yeah, the game is kind of hard. It'll get harder. <laughs> yeah. Stay on your toes. Yeah, especially uh, we're playing veterans, so... We, we, we need to team up and kill these guys. Okay. Alright, alright. Alright. Come on, Fifi, we got this. Never scared, Fifi. Never scared. Look at that. Look at look how vicious my dog is. Kind of scares me sometimes. Oh, also, you each character can learn magic in this game separately. Separately. Um. I'll show you in a minute. Oh dang! Who has that purple flashy move? This one? It's one of my skills. Oh, oh is it yours? Okay, that's kind of cool. Yeah. Yeah, it was flashy though. It was pretty flashy. I like it. All right. Uh, I guess we have to go inside. Not. Yeah, let's let's try this out. It says level four to five. I don't know if we should try that. Level four to. Ah, that's fine. <laughs> that's yeah, fine. If you say so. <laughs> oh, that's uh, fine. Okay, I'll make sure to grab your soul stone. Oh, I won't be dying. Don't worry. Ooh, is that a challenge? Ooh, I got five unspent stats points. I might might as well use that. Um, it's still loading. No. Yeah, it's um, a pretty long load. Yeah, I've never had this long a load in in, that, in this game. I guess because we we're, we're waiting for each other. I oh, guess. Yeah, yeah, that's probably it. We were probably just waiting for um, ribbon. Everyone to be loaded, yeah. No, I, I was in there first. Oh, you were? Okay. <laughs> Aren't you usually the last one? <laughs> uh, usually. <laughs> oh, dang it. Got this, bro. Oh my god, I don't. Let me go back. Let me go back and heal real quick. All right. I feel like um, also um, in this game, there's too much happening on screen. Yeah, I know. It's like a lot of. Oh my god. Oh my god. Heal, 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 heal. Thank you. Yo, tell. Um, try to see if you can find skills that give you health, that give you healing. Uh, yeah. I got level four. So. That might help you, cause um, that purple thing that I have, it gives me life whenever time I hit anybody with it. So. Oh really? Okay, oh, I'll check oh, my skills. Nice. So oh. that's that's why I don't I don't really have to use potions. Um, weapon generate and cause. Yeah, I don't see anything. Yeah, it's probably later on because I don't see anything. Let me skill. Let, let me spend some skill points. Yeah, these enemies are kind of. Tough. Yeah, they have they have quite a bit of life. That's why we have to work together. Like a family of four. Yeah. Okay, I'm coming. All right. Anyone here? Anyone at all? Where are you guys at? Oh, I saw I saw Avox. Do you, do you know where we're going, Avox? No. Uh, check 
the map. The okay, I see you guys. Okay, Raven, there you are. Okay, I guess we'll stop here for now. Um. Okay. Yeah. How much time? How, how much time you got? Twenty-two. Okay. Yeah, we'll stop here for now. All right. I'm, I'm at the middle part. Um. Uh, what happens when we die? Um. You get an option to either um restart in the beginning of the dungeon for a price, or to, um r resurrect in town for free. Okay. Cause I just died. Yeah, just just uh, spawn in the dungeon. It'll just toss you a bit of gold. Oh, it costs money, like gold. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. I haven't died yet, which is good. But I'll probably find out maybe in the next episode. Uh, is everyone here? I think I, I think we're still waiting for Avox. It won't let me resurrect, so I guess I have to go in town. Okay, that's fine. Um, yeah, we'll we'll meet you in the next episode. But that's pretty much all I got for this part of Torchlight 2. Hope you guys enjoyed and stay tuned for the next part. Until next time, this is Taos out. Alpha Compton out. Uh, Avox out. And Riven out. Right. Laters. <laughs> <laughs>